Time now for our shootout. Now, we do shootouts very rarely on the Cell Guru Show, but today we've got to do it because, like I said right in the beginning, this is a super hot category. When the Samsung Galaxy Note was released, people said it's too big, but that turned out to be a big hit. Now, in the economy smartphone category, almost every single company that exists in India has a 5-inch. And you've been asking us which is the best. So today, we're going to do a shootout. Micromax, Spice, and everybody else that has 5-inch smartphones. Today, we're going to actually have a shootout that takes into consideration every single feature that really matters to a user. Here we go. The 5-inch shootout in the economy smartphone category. The Dell Streak 5 pioneered it but didn't build a good product. The Samsung Galaxy Note popularized it and hit a home run and it seems the world loved it. This is the device we fondly call the phablet. But till a few months back, you had to have deep pockets not just to keep this phone but also to buy it. But not anymore. Many Indian manufacturers are coming to your rescue. Phablets are now available for the budget conscious as well. But while you may get a large screen, there may be some features that you compromise on given the low price. This is a no-holds-barred shootout of brand new Made in India phablets that you can choose from. The contenders are the Micromax Canvas 2 A110, the Spice Stella Horizon MI500, Intex Aqua 5.0 and the Zinc Cloud Z5. All these are 5 inches with capacitive screens. All of them are running on the Android 4.0 operating system and all of them are dual SIM phones and 3G ready. So what are the must-haves and the have-nots that you need to keep in mind while buying an economy phablet? A big phone makes a big statement. You don't want it to be an ugly statement. Thus, the looks, thickness and weight in a phone like this matters. The Micromax phone has curved edges with a wide bezel and seems to borrow its looks from a certain galaxy. The lightest from them all, weighing 164 grams. Zinc Cloud has a plastic textured back cover. Below the screen is the menu, swanked between two touch-sensitive Android keys. The phone is heavy to hold at 190 grams. The Intex Aqua 2 weighs around 199 grams. This too has a textured back cover. Below the screen, four touch-sensitive Android keys and no physical button on this one. Out of the four, the Spice Horizon scores the highest. A neat white back casing, slim and slick, but the heaviest at 205 grams. A big screen with a poor dull display? Nah. Large devices shout for a large pixel resolution and colors that are crisp and vivid. Sharp and bright icons add to the pleasure of swiping. The Micromax gets the top position here with a 480 into 854 pixel resolution. Although the other phones have a similar 400 into 800 pixel density, but the pictures seem much brighter on the canvas too. It's a huge screen and you don't want to struggle and swipe all day. Thus, you need great touchscreen response. The Spice phone took top honors here with all others close behind. On a big phone, you don't want to compromise on speed. Clicking and waiting endlessly for the phone to react can make you pull out your hair. This is why the processor speed is critical. Interestingly, the Micromax, the Spice and the Intex all use a 1 GHz dual-core processor. The Zinc phone loses out here with a 1 GB single core. Equally important is the RAM of the phone as the performance and the apps depend on it. All four phones have 512 MB RAM. That's a bare minimum that any phablet should have. Inbuilt memory is crucial as well, but more important is the existence of the memory card slot on the phone. We are glad that all four phones have expandable memory of up to 32 GB. A huge screen requires a huge battery. The screen, the features and the background apps drain out the battery and it is critical to have great battery backup. Zinc aces here with a 2500 mAh battery. Spice is a close second at 2400 mAh. Both Micromax and Intex have a 2000 mAh battery. The four phones that we have with us are all budget Androids and are priced well. At around 9500 rupees, Zinc Cloud Z5 is the least priced. The Micromax Canvas 2 is priced at 9,900 rupees. You can get the Intex Aqua 5 for around 11,000 rupees. For the Spice Stellar Horizon, you'll have to shell out around 12,500 rupees. Do you have the Indie TV Profit app? All the markets, all the news, and your own homemade, ready-made portfolio available there for you. We will right now answer what you should sell, what you should buy when markets are down. Download at IndieTVProfit.com slash apps. Get the best app from the channel you trust.